Hello, welcome to Crafting Kitty. My name is Erin and today it's Wednesday, so we're going to do some opening. I got, this should be my Hobie Halloween order, which is the last thing I made before my vow to not purchase anymore. Um, until Black Friday. <laughs> and then I also got a box from Mama G Gear. We're going to break into that. And I do not have a pattern for this poncho, but I adore this poncho and I bought it. And I'm pretty sure I can recreate it. So I'm going to. It's so cozy and comfy. I just, I love it. So I think I can do it. Fingers crossed. And if I do, I will definitely share. Okay, but... First, let's hop into the Hobie Hobby Halloween yarns. Um, this I got because they had their 50% off sale. And then I was able to, on the website, apply my birthday discount on top of that. So that seemed like an awfully good deal to me. And I went for it. Oh, it's pretty. Oh, it's pretty. Okay. So what did I get? I see lots of sparkles, which is never a bad thing. Okay. I got some Dahlia Halloween. Dahlia is 100% cotton. Oh, this is pretty. So it's got the purples, a light purple into a darker purple into a royal blue with a navy on the outside. That's pretty. This one is, uh, call it a super fine or a fine two. They want US 2.4 knitting needles, 3.5 to 4 millimeter crochet hooks, 200 grams, seven ounces, 800 meters, 874 yards. This is color number three. Color number three. Nice. I love Dahlia. Um, this is the Wild and Free Top from, <clears throat> excuse me, Ivy B Creates, done in Dahlia. Three cakes of the Bluebell. But I got, speaking of threes, I got three Universe XLs in this pretty colorway that that cake's a little mangled but that's okay look at this one the pretty pinks fuchsias some orange and black some purple in there oh and that sparkle i like the sparkle in this one is orange so it's pr it's really fun okay so universe xl it's uh premium acrylic made in turkey I believe this was turkey as well, but let me double check. No, I'm sorry. This is India. Dahlia was India. Turkey. Uh, 98 acrylic, 2% polyester, a lightweight three. It's a good three. Um, 100 grams, 3.5 ounces, 220 meters, 240 yards. They want... 4 to 5 millimeter knitting needles and 4 to 5 millimeter crochet hook. Uh, I love the little kitty cats on the labels. This one is color two. Color two. And then I got three more cakes of this one. I remember the name of this is Zombie Planet. And this will be regular universe. <clears throat> so universe Halloween. Again, premium acrylic made with hearts in Turkey. This is color three. Um, the greens, the purples. This one has a purple sparkle thread running through it, which is super pretty. Uh, color three. Uh, 98 acrylic, 2% polyester. This one is a one weight. Honestly, that looks a bit more like a two, but mm, I don't know, maybe a thick one. 
who knows? It's going to be pretty either way. I'm flipping it the wrong way. Uh, they want 3 to 3.5 millimeter knitting needles and a 3.5 millimeter crochet hook. I'm not reading any of the care instructions. I'm sorry. I just <laughs> wash it by hand. Take care of your stuff if you're going to take the time to make it. Um, four, I, I said the weight and then I just went on. 100 grams, 3.5 ounces, 462 yards, 505. 462 meters, 505 yards. Whoa. Where's Aaron's brain gone? Okay, what else did I get? I got another Dahlia. So Dahlia Halloween. The, look at that color. Look at how pretty that is. So it's orange. It's a kind of a gold into a darker orange, into a fuchsia, into a purple, into a black. That's pretty. That's so pretty. Oh man. Oh, so pretty. And then I got one of the universe sock. Ooh. Okay, this is pretty scratchy. Um, superwash wool. <laughs> um, made in Turkey, color four. It's the, it's purples and blues with a blue sparkle thread throughout. It is. 74% uh, wool, 24% polyamide, 2% polyester. It's a one weight. Yeah. Um, looks like sock weight to me. This is color four. 100 grams, 420 meters, 459 yards. They want three millimeter knitting needles. And they don't give a crochet hook size. Um... You can wash at 30 degrees, no triangles, no iron, no drying. So this is going to be a, a hand wash sock. And I do plan on making socks with it. So to aid in my sock adventure. And then more sock adventures. I got this Halloween sock wool. Um, they say it's super wash wool. Made in Turkey. This is color seven. It's the gray black. And orange, there's like two tones of gray in there. Kind of a, a silvery and then more of a steel or a gunmetal gray. And then the black. And then the orange. Um, Halloween sock wool. 75% wool. 25% polyamide. One, it, it's a sock. Uh, three millimeter knitting needles. Same care instructions. Wash at 30 degrees. Don't dry. Color seven. That's pretty. That is pretty. Sorry, see, I'm checking to see if that was a, a dye error or what was going on there. It does look like some black dye got on the orange, which is not a problem. It just adds to the charm of the socks. And then, gotta get the glitter sock. Got one of the glitter socks. Um, it's got the pink, the purple, a gray, a, a charcoal. It's got a uh, pinky magenta-y glitter in it. That's really pretty. This was something vampire, vampire kiss. Uh, I don't remember, but it's superwash wool made in Turkey, color six, 73% uh, wool, 25% polyamide, 2% polyester. It's a one weight, so it's a sock weight. Uh, 100 grams, 3.5 ounces, 420 meters, 559 yards, 3 millimeter knitting needles, and again, wash at 30 degrees, don't dry, no iron. This one you can dry clean. You can dry clean. That's pretty. That's fun. I am so excited to start making socks, if you can't tell. And then the piece de resistance. Oh, what? I got two candies. What? I got a twister. Um, so I got one of the Halloween twisters. This is color two, made in Turkey, 55% uh, cotton, 45% acrylic, 
This is so nice and fun. I love the labels. The cute little ghosty and kitty cat. Um, so 50, I already said that. It's a two weight. Where's my center pole? Did it get stuck in there? Yeah, it got stuck in there. It's stuck. There you go. Um, it, it, they want three to four millimeter knitting needles, 3.5 to four millimeter crochet hooks. You can wash this one at 40 degrees. Still do not dry it. Still do not triangle this. Do not triangle this. You can iron, you can dry clean, and you can do whatever that box means. That's, I don't know what that is. Um, so color two, I don't remember what the name of this one was, but it's got kind of a golden into orange into Ooh, kind of bronzy browns and then into the is that black or chocolate on the outside I don't know my eyes are playing tricks upon me what do you, I think that's a chocolate brown on the outside I like it it's very very pretty I did not give you yardage did I where are you yardage where are you uh, 250 grams, 8.8 .8 ounces, 1,000 meters, 1,093 yards. Boom. I love it. It is so, so pretty. I am so excited. So excited. I love all the Halloween colors and all that good stuff. Okay. So then I have this box from Mama G. Mama G. I'll be honest. I'm sorry, Mama G. This has been here for a bit and I have not opened it because as with everything lately, I am behind. <laughs> but we're catching up. We're getting there, aren't we? So let us see what we got from Mama G land. So this box is from I gave something to Mama G to help with the ah, the bills for Oscar de Wilde and I'm so so happy he's doing well. I I couldn't be more thrilled. Let's see. Ooh, what's in here? Okay, so we got a we got a card on the top. So let's start there. It says Aaron and Brian. Oh, thank you so much. Look at the kitty cats. So I am totally a Hallmark crier and I'm not going to be able to read your card, but thank you. Thank you so much. Otherwise I will be, I will be crying. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, okay. Let us see what she has sent. <gasps> Look at how pretty this is. It's a shawl in a cake. A shawl in a cake. This is um, a medium four, but that's, they count the halo in this one. So it's a Trixie one. Um, 5.3 ounces, 150 grams, 481 yards, 440 meters. Machine wash, gentle, lie flat to dry, 58% cotton. 39% acrylic, 3% other fibers. I did not know these had cotton. That's really interesting. Um, they want five millimeter knitting needles and six millimeter crochet hook. This one is mindful mauve. That's really pretty. And I like, can oh, the reflection, how that works up. That is so pretty. Thank you. I love it. I have shown a ball, but I've not had shawl and a cake and then whoa what is this oh what is this oh <laughs> it's a sticker with with a sloth lying on a llama <laughs> i love it i'm gonna put that over there and try to keep it out of bingo's little fingers and let us see what else is in here oh a mandala sparkle look at that that is pretty. It's got um, a silver sparkle and pinks and grays all throughout. 
that is pretty um this is 3.5 ounces 100 grams 328 yards 300 meters machine wash and dry lightweight three 3.75 millimeter knitting needles and a five millimeter crochet hook don't bleach it keep away from your triangles no triangles i really like that that's really pretty what color is this one nova nova nice i like it bingo's gonna claim this one and that's okay we have to let her claim some things right and then let's make unpredictable mood swings happen <laughs> Card. And then, oh, it's a little door hanging. You are amazing. I love it. That is so cute. One, can I put it on? Decoration. And then we. I mean, like, could there be more? Yes, there could. This is a three pack of shawl and a cake. Three pack shawl and a cake. Look at it. these are Mama G's colors. What are you doing, lady? Okay, I appreciate it. Um, 5.3 ounces. Well, I already did this, all the specs on the other shawl and a cake. I assume it's the same. You know what, it's, it's different. This one has 58% cotton. This one has 61% cotton. Huh. Okay, so it's different. Let's go through it. Uh, 5.3 ounces, 150 grams, 581 yards, 440 meters, machine wash, gentle, lay flat to dry, 61% cotton, 34% acrylic, 5% other fiber. It's a medium four. They want five millimeter knitting needles a uh, six millimeter crochet hook and I thought it was gonna be the same so I was just gonna keep it in this in the package to make them all stay nice and together but now it does it even feels different what what it doesn't it doesn't have the big as big of a halo that's cool this is really interesting who would have thought Okay, so that's what they think it will look like. That's pretty. And I love that this has a blue tinsel through it. That is cool. Shawl and a cake. Nice. So, oh, I, I didn't tell you what colorway this was. Prism. Prism. It does look like a prism. That is fabulous. Okay, I'm not going to put that in. Oh, we have one more. Oh, we have another of the purple one. Of the, no, no, this is Mindful Mauve. Mindful Mauve. Nice. Now it can just get bigger. Bigger. And then, oh, some pride ribbon. Oh, yes. Let's make some rainbow bows. I will. Nice. I actually love making bows. Maybe I'll do a tutorial on it. I like making wreaths and then I make my own big bows. Let me know if that's something that might be of interest. If not, I understand too. Oh, look at this rainbow. Is this the cupcake? This is cupcake. I have not had cupcakes from Lion Brand. I, um, so cupcake, Lion Brand cupcake. Oh, this is soft and fun. This is um 5.3 ounces, 150 grams, 590 yards, 540 meters, machine wash and dry, 100% acrylic, lightweight three. It's very, very much like Mandala. Um, seems like maybe it's a touch, a touch thinner. A touch thinner there. Let me know what your thoughts are. I love it though. It's beautiful. Uh, they want a three point, yeah, three point seven five millimeter knitting needles and a five millimeter crochet hook. It works up into that beautiful rainbow. Look at this; it's called Jelly Bean Bon Bon Haruko. Huh? That's 
That's cute. So it's literally B <laughs> bean. Oh, I wonder is that is bonbon jelly in French? I wonder. But there you go. Cupcake. And then there's one more. One more bag of awesomeness. Well, I guess it's a three pack of awesomeness. This looks like more cupcake. Woman, well, you are so kind and generous. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm sorry, I still got the sniffles from your card and allergies, but mostly your card. Oh, this is what they chomps is going to love this um so it's another cupcake uh specs are the same and this one is called peas and carrots oh, i love it peas and carrots <laughs> so the oh it even looks like it has some speckles in can you see that at all in the white one, it's speckled green and orange. Chomps has an unnatural love of leprechauns. So he, he wakes up on St. Patrick's Day and the leprechauns turned his milk green and he was hooked. He loves leprechauns. He gets so excited. He has to chase the, the trail of coins to his green milk because he's sure that every year now they leave him green milk. And they have and will continue to as long as the excitement continues. <laughs> and even like Easter, we were, I was, um, hiding easter eggs for their easter egg hunt and he came out and was hunting easter eggs and he started telling me how the easter eggs were where the leprechauns were born from and so that's why he had to collect all the easter eggs i don't know how leprechauns became associated with easter in his mind he was was he four or three and a half he was around four when when he was talking like that so but it was adorable and he is going to love his leprechaun yard oh this is fun thank you thank you so much this is amazing and I, thank you i love it all thank you thank you thank you i will see you all tomorrow with something I think I put cards on top of my calendar and I don't know what was on the calendar, but 